Welcome back everybody to Mass Effect Andromeda and we are currently on another Angaran, Angaran planet, I almost can't say that, uh, Vold, which is completely covered in ice and we are supposed to be setting out a new outpost here, although I'm starting to think that's a terrible idea because it's freezing. Um, there are three monoliths so I'm imagining we will have to get them going and that will probably stop the the snow and the ice and the cold, I don't know, probably, but we'll find out. Um, so we're currently on our way to this particular place here. I can't even set it on the map. There's all this that we have to explore. Um, but we're going to head this here, here first, especially because being outside is actually having an impact on our life support. So we have to make it quick place for a secret hideout snow and ice camouflages everything keep going rider try not to make any sudden movements you'll probably be what, like, like well, trying they, to get out of the ice they really mean business, don't they? iridium come on please tell me there's shelter here Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Hey. Life support is back online. Whoa. I understand. We need need one of their suits. Can I not scan it now? Heard about Kiva. I still can't find him. His sister came through here. Set out alone to search for him. And she's as tough as her brother. I don't really get why we're. Temperatures are below freezing and continuing to fall. As soon as I'm done, it's environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Life support is back online. What's going on? Some of what you need here on Vold. The rest, out and about. So, we should be out there looking for Michelle. Michelle. 
Sun was shown from The Walking Dead. Right, um... Okay, so we've come through the base. Console and something. Oh, this is a whole base. Oh, we're just in a base now. Okay. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, never mind. We haven't got to that bit yet. I can just about imagine how cold it must be in here. Okay. substitute for real medical attention but you'll survive long enough to reach it problem is the caches are empty right now we're strained and no one's been out there to replenish supplies there's no time to waste i'll help with whatever you need supply crates are stacked by the wall over there directions to the caches are with them you have a vehicle of course good get going and he uh more fun and games Okay. Uh, if you need patching up, you'll have to wait. A patrol just came through and I need to see to them. Is it just you here? Volunteer medics are hard to come by, especially ones who can handle Vold. It's actually warm in here. Those heaters work pretty well. We don't use them for heat. They generate artificial sun, so we don't go dark. What do you mean, go dark? Right, I suppose you wouldn't know about that. Our bodies generate energy from sunlight. If we don't get enough, our immune systems weaken and our bioenergy slows. We go dark. Mm-hmm. I'll come back if I need anything. I'll be here. Right. These are the emergency medical supplies the doctor mentioned. We have to get them to the caches. Sam, you saving the location data? Of course, Pathfinder. Looks like supplies aren't getting through to the resistance. Bet they have an officer we can talk to. There's a lot to do here. Okay, trading favors. team on Haval. I'm Anyik Dozil, commander of this encampment. You're welcome here as an ally of the Angara. 
I appreciate the warm welcome. It's a joke. To break the ice? Get it? Warm welcome? Ice? Call that a joke. Probably a translation thing. Perhaps. Strange jokes aside, I hope you will join our fight against the Ket. We could certainly use the help. We've held the Ket at bay, but have been unable to deal a decisive blow. The longer things drag on, the greater our disadvantage. That's why I came here. To help. If you want to know where you can make a difference, go to the post that overlooks the valley. Nothing happens on Vold without our lookouts knowing about it. Before you go, is there anything else I can help you with? I've met Ephra. He's... interesting. He's never been good at first impressions. He can be stern, but he's exactly what the Resistance needs. Ephra took a scattered band of civilian fighters and molded them into an effective army. What success we've had against the Ket is entirely due to his leadership. Most people seem to really respect him. Because he would do anything for his people, he inspires the same in us. We may not always agree with Ephra, but we'd follow him to the end of the stars. That's it for now. I'll be here if... Yeah, I'm not gonna have... I'm not gonna use all the... conversation... options, otherwise we will be here until the end of time. <clears throat> Should be going out there with you. Waiting around makes me unhappy. I'll keep my comms open so I can keep up with what you're doing. Sounds good. In the meantime, is there anything I can help with? Nope. I don't think he's the person I need to speak to. Okay, there's speak to Olisk. There we go. Says, I'll find her. Something I can do for you? You the requisitions officer? I hear you're having supply issues. Of course not. I don't know what you've heard, but everything is running fine. I saw the messages sent to you. What are you hiding? Keep your voice down. I need to keep this news contained. No one knows the shipments have stopped. If word gets around, we'll have a serious morale drop. I need to investigate this quietly. You have any leads? Not much. The supplies make it planetside, but never reach the base. The obvious answer is the Ket. Sabotage is their style. We changed our drop point, but no luck. I can't send someone to investigate without word getting around. I guess there's no avoiding it eventually. I can take a look at the drop point. That way no one will panic. I can't sanction an official search, but I also can't stop you from investigating on your own. The nav point for the last drop location is in my personal console. You seem to be adept at decryption, so I'll let you figure out the rest. Decryption successful, Pathfinder. Updating your nav system with a supply drop point. Right, what else have we got? So we've got the way out, so we're going to head there. in the cold in it right let's have a look so that's the drop point memory oh my god how far do we need to go whoa Let's 
So how are we getting there? I brought the snacks last time. But I never get care packages from Iron, do I? You're so good at guilt. I don't even things. see any extreme Tempest, we're gonna need the nomad. My position. Deploying forward station. Good luck, Ryder. Automated protocols activated. Deploying forward station. Uh, Mining zones have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. Environmental temperatures are within acceptable. Okay, Sam, what's Vold got for us? Cat activity appears to be centered around this large central command post. According to Resistance Intelligence, the base coordinates all Cat military efforts on Vold. And taking it down will cripple their operations. In theory. However, given the trouble the Angara Resistance has had infiltrating the base, it will not be a simple task. I recommend a more cautious approach that starts with the investigation of smaller Ket installations. What about the Angara? The Resistance? What's their status? Resistance dispatches indicate there is someone in Hojara who needs help. We can okay. visit Tekix, a larger and more established Angara Dar that is nearby. Sounds good. Thanks, Sam. Pathfinder, Vault's temperature range is fixed well below freezing, with pockets of even more severe conditions. This necessitates the use of the Nomad. I advise against prolonged exposure to the cold. Got it. Don't crash the car. Our scans have detected remnant monoliths, which suggests the presence of a vault. And that means we might be able to melt this ice cube. All right. We've got our work cut out for us. Let's get going. Who well, else is we use this? So we might be able to do that drop point while we're here. Uh, it's right over there, so I might as well just do it. Trading favor, speak to the resistance lookout. I'm reading a severe temperature drop. How's your Why was this not Whoa. here? Didn't mean to sneak up on you. The alien, the one that helped out on Havaro. Didn't expect an alien to help. They've mostly tried to kill and enslave us. So that's amazing. You are amazing. Shut up, Biscuit. <laughs> You're embarrassing. You shut up. I'm being charming, right? The Angara have been wonderful to us, including yourself. So thank you. See? We're building bonds here to seek. So what's out there? Any tips? As a start, you could join our fight in Hajara, where those red lights are. I hear someone's looking for help. Or you could just go there and kill some cat. They're everywhere. Anything else you need to know? We've been stationed here forever, so we're experts. Nah, I'm alright. I'll figure I'll it out. Back to you. Take I'm reading a normal temperature range, Pathfinder. Yeah, yeah. What's this? Go to uh. Lots of respect for the Angara, the way they fight. It's almost Krogan. They're a tough bunch. I hope the Angara know we're nothing like the Ket. I wouldn't want them as an enemy. Uh... 
the wrong way. Jesus, I hate this place. Oh, we're back near our ship. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Uh, who's star? Who are you? Pathfinder, this area can be mined for resources. You can extract minerals via your mining interface. Jesus. trigger the outpost is all the way down there so I'm gonna make my way there Exactly. She did used to swear up and down about a stubborn old fossil, usually while hitting something. Stubborn old fossil. She's called me worse on a good day. I 
Activating automated forward station deployment. I would not like to be lost out here on my own. Whatever you think of it, this is a beautiful planet. Thinking about a frozen moon, I would... Right. Once stranded on, almost lost my good toe. <laughs> it's good toe. have been added to your nav system, Pathfinder. Resistance lookout mentioned Angara who were captured by cats. I wonder if Hajara might know more about this. They might, but where exactly am I looking? Oh, great. Looks like an Angaran settlement. <laughs> Let's see if someone here needs help. Well, I found it anyway. It was an accident. job I did. Drilling for Ezo on an ice planet. Someone around here probably knows what that ice is for. Ice everywhere and they hang on to that piece. What's so special about it? Environmental temperatures are within acceptable limits. We can't just attack an entire kept you know base. That alien people have been talking about. Some say we can't trust you. But if you're here to fight Kev, that's good enough for me. I appreciate the vote of confidence. Kept kill people. They take our families and we never see them again. Anyone who fights against that has to be better than them. So, will you fight them? I know the location of the labor camp where they took my uncle. I'll get your uncle. Here's the nav point of the labor camp. Please hurry. Nilge may not have much time. Okay. We are going to track that. It's right here. Uh, can we go over? This reminds me of the Marco, and I remembered the name. Marco. Or Mako. Mako Marco. How'd you meet Cash? A few years ago, I was running with a mercenary band, mostly smuggling work. Nova Force. Ambitious name for a small time crew. On one of the jobs, I got caught by Cash. Made a deal. I got her some experimental prototypes out of Terminus. She didn't turn me in. It became a thing. She was always good for jobs, paid well, and upfront. Credits helped me go independent. But then I got suspicious. All the things she was asking me to get. So I asked. That's when I heard about the initiative. She brought you on. Oh yeah. I bought the pitch, like everyone else.
Life support at one hundred percent. Lied to you? Nah, she's not the type. I'm pretty sure none of us really knew what we were getting into. Bamboozled. No. Point of interest. I don't get why that's point of interest. Nice word. Yeah, I learned it from Sid. She's into some weird old human shit. Good name for a drink. The Bamboozler. <laughs> I try it. We are nearing the nav point provided by Soka Esau on Aya. Looks like Soka's supplier is dead. Uh, and there it is. Activating automated forward station deployment. Sid gets me so frustrated. I try to be firm. She pushes back. I lay down the law. She pushes some more. See, that's your problem. Kids need boundaries, sure. But they also want to know you're not the enemy. Our dad would not have agreed with you. Your dad sounds like a piece of work. Special ops, right? Yeah, something like that. You never went. This is the Ket labor camp Skiot talked about. Be careful. Looks heavily guarded. How was that? Something went on.
you're here to rescue us. The control panel is right there. Shut this down. Once I have a weapon, I'm gonna destroy these cats. Come on up. Temperature is falling, Pathfinder. Life support is back online. Oh, armor. Nice. Oh, I cannot open this. I'm reading a temperature decrease. Of course you are. I'm outside. Oh. It's there. Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Just in time. Might have given us another day at most. No thanks to Rana's jabs. See what I mean? Can't hear that. How'd you find us anyway? Your nephew Ski Out was trying to get you rescued. Good boy. He's got potential, Bill. So you've said before. The resistance needs to be debriefed. We'll head back to base as soon as possible. What about the data drive? We have to deliver it to Buckle before she can start the analysis. 
Interesting. Seems we have to depend on our rescuer for more than a rescue. Can you deliver this drive to Tetchik's? If we work together, no time will be wasted. Okay. I'll go there as soon as I can. Perfect. Buxil will be in her workshop. I hope we meet again under better circumstances. I'm detecting below normal temperature. Right, I'm gonna have a look at. Okay, there's a Ford station drop point. And meet the family. We're actually not far from find an outpost site. We're gonna do that. What's that noise? Sometimes I wonder what Sid and I'd be like if we'd had a better home life. Maybe we wouldn't have grown up to be so difficult. Difficult's good, Fedra. You took what you had and made it yours. That's all any of us can hope for. If only you'd raised us, old man. Ha <laughs> ha, you would have turned out so much worse. Maybe uh. a better shot, though. Maybe. <laughs> It's quite funny, maybe a better shot. This is a bridge. I wonder if we can set up the outpost already. Oh, I see it down there. Looks like cat ahead. We should be careful. Kept machines up ahead. Coming up again. Oh shoot. Wow. Uh, do you not think this is... No, it's not. Go through here. Nope, it won't. How far are we? Oh, gosh, we're nowhere near. I thought that was it. Scan successful. Establish settlement requires uh, Okay. So we can't do it. This location could support an outpost. 
but the planet is not yet viable. Okay. Point of interest. So we can't really do that yet. And there isn't a Ford station here, so we're going to head over to one of the monoliths. Oh, what's that? Remnant site ahead, Pathfinder. It could have defenses in place. Interesting, because there's nothing here. <laughs> Jesus, you scared me. Jeez. Manual says the Nomad's good for all weather conditions, but they did those tests in the Milky Way. I swear I will turn this car around. So... The temperature is falling, Pathfinder. Why? Where's the entrance? Check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. <sighs> Get ready to fight! What do you mean? The temperature is falling, Pathfinder. That 
was fun. Environment check. Temperatures are within acceptable parameters. Okay, there's a gravity well. Oh no, it's not a gravity well, it's just a... Okay, so we need to... You should be able to locate these glyphs, Pathfinder. Wonder if I'd get anything on the scanner. Okay, so the other one's on top here, which is probably why this is here. Yeah, that should be fine. Oh, okay. Uh, oh, no, that's fine. Almost. Okay. Uh... Okay. I'm just gonna use that. I was struggling to figure that one out. Oh shoot. Oh. So this one's active.
Look, it's easy. You just pull the hinge back and snap the upgrade straight on the barrel. Does it seem secure? It's secure. I promise. Right. Viability 13%. There's a point of interest there. Another point of interest, although I'm not entirely sure what that's about. Um, we've got another monolith here, so we're probably going to go there afterwards. Um, actually, you know what? We're going to go over here and get this... Uh... Back in my day, upgrades were handmade. Custom fitted. None of this off the rack snap together shit. Don't say uphill both ways. Don't say it. Turians didn't used to be so damn lippy either. Yeah, there's a laser connecting them now. Uh, what the hell is this place? Indeed. The hostage? They were carrying explosives, and this looks like... Some kind of cat detonator? What were they doing? I say we search the area. Oh, come on. bunch of things here but gotta be okay every time you say that I believe you less doesn't make it less true okay so we just follow the road apparently
some sort of guard post. There's a dar up ahead. Gotta hand it to these Angara. They're tough. Fortunate. That's Techix, according to my map. Let's go tell Buxel about her brother. Hey, can you help me with something? There's a wraith close near you. I lost its movement. A wraith? Will you scan for it and let me know where it's hiding? Um, uh, not yet. I think I will pass. Right, we've got skill points. Let's just spend those while we're here. Eleven. Hmm. Must have leveled up more than once. Um. Let's have a look at shockwave. Distance by 50%, that's what I need. Uh, assault rifles, I'm going to increase that. And tech. Oh, turbocharge. You can do that one on. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Don't really know what that's supposed to do, but. So he's probably going to have black cannon. Launches projectiles that split on impact and then air bursts into shrapnel to carve an aftermath of destruction. Yes, please. we go. Right. Adept is now unlocked. Yeah, I'm not really that fussed about it though. Inventory. We've got a lot going on here. Do we have to go back to Habitat 7? Uh, oh, that's a codex. Ooh. <laughs> Find an outpost site. We need 40%. Activate monolith. That should do the trick. Right. I'm actually going to um, wrap this up here and we'll continue in the next part with activating the monoliths. So we've done one, um, there's two left, and then hopefully we that will bring out the viability of this place because at the moment things are looking pretty grim. <laughs> um, I'll just have a look around, look at that. That is crazy. That is absolutely crazy. Well, minus 41 degrees. Oh my god, I'm about to freeze my ass off. Um, right. With that said, stay cool and safe, everyone, and I'll see you in the next one.